Hello my brothers and sisters in nerdiness, welcome back to the spider's web and in this video we're going to be continuing our unboxing of the uh, Mythic Battles Ragnarok Kickstarter campaign that I got but we are not going to be doing Mythic Battles Ragnarok it sounds weird but we have a crossover game or a crossover box which it's not Mythic Battles at all. It's Conan. There we are. I'll pop them over to one side. We'll get a knife of opening. We'll turn the box upside down. We will slice into the cellophane. And we will see what's in here. This is a game that I've had for a while, I've, and again, it's one that I've not finished painting, and it's a game, another one that I've not played for a year or two, or three, or four, or five. Um, in fact, it's a good few years since I've played this, and uh, I don't think Ollie has ever actually seen this, this particular game. Well, that's the cover, as you can see one of the characters from the um, Ragnarok box set is there on the cover and Gods of the North across the red drifts and mail clad forms two figures glared at each other in that utter desolation only they moved the frosty sky was over them the white illuminated plain around them the dead men at their feet Slowly through the corpses they came as ghosts might come to a tryst through the trembles of a dead world. In the brooding silence they stood face to face. This expansion requires components from the Conan core box and from the Mythic Battles Ragnarok core box. It's for ages 14 plus for 1 to 5 players and takes about 90 minutes. In here we have one scenario book, 17 hero sheets, 6 equipment cards, 4 spell cards, 47 life points markers and 71 overlord action tiles. So the minis, there's no minis in this. It is just literally um, cards, tiles, that kind of thing. So we'll put that to one side. <coughs> we'll move it over there so we have a little bit more space and we will zoom in a touch this is gods of the north so again i will have to get conan out and add these into the in with the on the other conan stuff that i have um and again it's just very similar to the the way conan is set up in fact it's it is, it's, it's just another rule book in the Conan series because that's all it is. Um, and we have a solo or cooperative campaign. And there we are. Just tell you everything. And this part now is the campaign book. We have Frigg there. Yes, I think it's Frigg. One or the other, one of the Seers. And this is telling you exactly um, how you set up your encounters, how you, um, what you need to do to play your special rules, everything else will come in here and you're using either um, the tiles from uh, Ragnarok or the tiles I th no, you've used the tiles from Ragnarok. I thought it was the tiles from Conan. We uh, I thought I saw tiles from Conan there, but I don't. These are all the Ragnarok tiles. Um, the only thing from Conan we seem to be using is these um, tiles, these um, tokens. Obviously, the um what they call it the uh oh what's it called what's it called what's it called let me go back and show you i know i know what it says i just can't think of what it's called um these bits here the dashboards um 
So we're using all this type of thing from Conan, but we're using all the minis and the boards uh, to play on uh, from Ragnarok. So yeah, it's going to be an interesting concept. So we have that. Um, again, we have one in French now. This seems weird. The French one seems thicker and it's on a different type of paper. This is quite matte, whereas this is quite shiny and glossy. Weird. Is there anything different inside? No, the paper inside still feels the same glossy paper, but the cover is different. Everything, and it looks. If you look closely, it looks different as well. I don't know whether it's just me or not, but it feels like a different cardstock for the cover. But again, we'll pop that to one side because I don't need the French thing. So again, if anybody wants it, it's blah, 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 blah. Next, we have these character sheets. There we go. So this is what we have and I will, as per usual, I'll work my way through them and you can um, stop. Right, this is the English side, I've just realised. I've just noticed, so we'll go with the English side and we'll just take these off. Um, names may be changed slightly. Not saying completely, but just slightly. To make it fit in, possibly with um, Conan. Not every name's changed. Lagatha's not changed. But you never know, there may be some names that get changed. Brunhild. Yep. Zelda. Oh, Zalata the Wanderer. This is how I knew that it was um this was this side was the English side because that would that's the French version. La instead of the Hrim. Well, I don't know how that's pronounced. Thorfinn. Asgrim. Rudd. I think some of these have been changed, others haven't. I mean, this is... Um, her name's not Sonya, it's... What's her name in this? What's her name in this? I've got on the cards here, let's have a look. Uh, da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Thrud, Thor's daughter in Ragnarok, where is in this? Maybe Red Sonya, don't know. And Heimdall, that's the spelling of Heimdall is changed. But yeah, there we are. That's all of those. That's all the ones on the player dashboards. And then we have all these little cards in fact let's get these cards open and we can have a look at them i need to get something sorted out with these because what i've had what i put these in from the original sets isn't big enough now without grabbing these in so um, i need something different because i have them in a little plastic container and um i don't mean these particular cards but the character tokens so we have these uh, one side we have the actual item and the other side we have that back so we'll look at these first so we have a heavy sword heavy axe throwing axes let's zoom in uh, throwing axes studded leather armor frost armor frost dagger Epe Lore. These are the. Yes. 
heavy sword, heavy axe, throwing axes, leather studded armour, frost armour, frost dagger. Again, French cards, English cards, don't need the French ones, they only put to one side. Once again, if anybody wants them, get in touch. And then we have these cards which have that back. <coughs> we have Freeze, Chilling Grasp, Ice Bolt, Umiya's Retribution, Gel, Um, gel, yeah, these are the French ones once again. Pop them to one side. I don't know what they they just these kind of things, just basically a repeat of these. Um, so I don't need to look at those. So they are cards that go to one side, and now we have a shed load of these things. Um, I have two sheets, two big sheets, um, all with different characters on. As you can see, all we need to do is punch these out and when we come to play, we can use them um, as we just need to take the appropriate um, mini out and we can then, um, what's the phrase I'm looking for? My brain has suddenly gone bleh, as though it's not don't want to work anymore um yeah so i'm not going to take all of these out i'm going to leave them in the box for the time being um because i don't have it don't have the corner stuff handy but we have this particular sheet this one sheet and then we have another sheet of sorry another two sheets of sorry an, another sheet and a bit of these kind of tiles um but this sheet and a bit of this type of tile um some of them are oh no 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 they they are all english that's why i thought some of them were french um if i turn this over yeah so yeah we have these and uh, let's zoom out so you get an idea we have all of these kind of things in there we have two as i say full sheets of those and the third sheet contains some of those tokens or some of those cards but it's also um contains the character tokens um that you that we'll need for playing the game um so we have shed load of things to use in uh conan um, but as I said, I'm just going to leave these all in here now and uh, when I get round to sorting them out, I will sort them out. It's that simple. So that's all we have in this Conan set. Um, we have those. We have these. Um, what should we call it? These character boards. And these we can come on. Run into it. I thought I'd open them up, I haven't. So we'll just push that. Try and get all these back into this bag. And it goes up a, little, a lot further than I actually thought it did. So I'll put all them back in there. We will also add in these cards uh, just to make sure they don't get damaged. We'll lie them in there. We'll put the rule book in here as well. And we'll put the lid back on. And we'll lift up the camera so you can see the box once more lovely artwork as usual with monolith games but that's it for this video i hope you've enjoyed it until next time as always stay safe and take care god bless and bye for now